hello guys so we will be making this text today so I will show you how how it gonna look like so that's how it gonna look like when we will uh, do this tutorial so you will learn with me step by step how to make this beautiful animated text so let's begin our tutorial so what we are gonna do is we will just uh, go to the titles here and uh, you can choose any default title let's suppose I'm choosing this one uh, title 34 that's what I chose and that's how it looks like so we're gonna make some changes here uh, animated animated and go to the advanced <coughs> and remove this one and uh, we will same do the same thing again bring it down one more uh, animated <coughs> go to advance delete this section and make a change animated text again bring the third one here down go to the advanced section here delete this one and we just need this the bigger text so it is uh, Roboto bold that's the font name you can change uh, any font you like or you have one if I, if you have a better one that's that will be a good idea so uh, w what we made it is uh, make made is animated text in Filmora that's how it should look like so now simply if you see animated text and then filmora so that's how it should look like so we'll just merge them uh, or make it closer so that it won't be too long and uh, you can play around with the fonts or, or size so it's uh, let's say 74 we will choose uh, 90 for now so that it looks a <coughs> uh, little better we, uh, when playing <coughs> as you can see here I'm just increasing the font size and that's how it should look like alrighty so so the first part is almost done it's uh, text is placed here so now we will add some uh, green screen effect so what, what, what we will do is go to our uh, <coughs> sample colors in the media section sample colors you will bring this green screen effect here on the timeline drag it and now you will just make it the, according to this size or this proportion so whatever your text comes in or you your text can fit in so that's how it it, it should look like or you can reduce it more to place it here or just uh, by using your arrow keys and uh, there we are so that's how it should look like let's see so we will reduce the size a little bit and make it here and yeah one more thing we will uh, place the uh, on the text we can go to its uh, animation and we will choose as uh, let me choose here this one uh, left uh, this drop one so we will double click this one so this effect gonna be that's how it's gonna look like on all the text text in and drop one so this effect in animation so in text in animation drop one keep in mind already okay let's go back again so that's how 
and then there's a strike through of this green screen comes in where the green screen comes in so we have to place this green screen just control C and then control V oops uh, let's place it here and then move it here again place it here and then move it here so that's how your green screen gonna be in all those text if you can see <clears throat> that's how it should look like it's, it's too big too large here so we will make it small make it small that's how and in Filmora it's going a little in so we will make it or uh, according to the right proportion of this text so that it won't feel awkward so just keep in mind that things should be aligned and look good when you're working but it's all your choice it's all your choices Filmora is yours so this is the first first part is done so I'm gonna just export this video so uh, I will export this video and then in the second part I will import this video as a video file in Filmora so uh, let's go to the second part all right so uh, I'll, uh, I, I have exported that video file and now I'm importing it uh, on my timeline so you see this one fancy text or fancy text animation in film or also uh, whatever you make so that's how uh, because uh, I have already done it so I've imported it in this one so uh, now we will place uh, we will do some uh, animation or uh, as you can see this one here so you will go here this the green screen comes in double click this one go to your chroma key and that's you see it's been done so no more green screen because <clears throat> it's been completed in in chroma key by clicking the chroma key here now what you will do is place your text whatever text you want to <coughs> position here you can do it separately so go to your text any text you want to place here there you are and we have placed this text as you can see it's looking very bad so we will um, choose some good font for instance let's see this one and we will uh, make it uh, we'll just make it and we will uh, choose any font so uh, I'm just choosing for instance uh, by default font Verdana and we will reduce its uh, looking uh, its size font size so that's where we want it to come here you can I believe you're following my instructions correctly very well so you will just place it here in the small place of this green screen and now you can stretch it how are you gonna stretch it go to advanced by selecting this Photologic Studio this, the size the font and then uh, you will do some Oops, not this one. Let's try this one. Yeah, so you can expand it. You can expand it. So you just bring it here. And you see this one. That's the right place. <clears throat> okay. 
how much you want to expand and how much you want to keep it so just make a position here I think it's still a little out so you will just place this position here by choosing the arrow key from your keyboard and uh, you can also reduce the size if you want um, like this piece touching right here so I can go and reduce it to let's try 21 I think that looks better so it's done already so let's give it a try here oops okay let's play no it's not coming the way we want it so we have to place it where it comes where it begins that's the place where it should come right here so it should come here All right A little awkward so you can adjust the place okay let's give it a try again there we are and where you want it to finish so you want to finish it here okay so let's see so you want to finish it right here it's a little out already so it's done okay so now the second thing is we again gonna copy this title so we will place it here where we want the the next text to come to appear on the screen and I think that's the right place I have made it okay right landing so see that looks good too sometime alrighty third and that should be the place I believe all right let's take a look here there you are but you can always always change the place the the placeholders the the just pause it move the head here choose the text where you want it to be displayed okay so we don't want things to look too awkward and uh, there we are so you can do your rendering and uh, but that's how it should look like fancy text animation and filmora all right there we are okay guys so this video is complete and stay tuned for more if you have any questions uh, you can ask me in your comments have a wonderful day bye